Are you ready to dive into the world of 3D creation with Blender? This powerful, free, and open source 3D suite is perfect for beginners and experts alike. From modeling and sculpting to animation, rendering, and even video editing. Getting started. One, download Blender. The first step on your 3D journey is to download Blender from the official website, blender.org. Make sure to get the latest version to take advantage of all the newest features. Two, familiarize yourself with the interface. 3D viewport, this is where you'll spend most of your time creating and manipulating your 3D models. Properties panel, here you can adjust settings for materials, textures, rendering, and more. Timeline, essential for animation, this panel lets you control the sequence and timing of your keyframes. Outliner, this panel helps you keep track of all the objects in your scene. Three, basic navigation, keyboard shortcuts. Learn essential shortcuts like G for grab, R for rotate, S for scale. Learning resources. One, online tutorials, YouTube, channels like Blender Guru, CG Cookie, and Grant Abbott provide excellent tutorials. Udemy and Skillshare. Paid courses can offer structured learning paths and in-depth projects. Two, Blender's built-in documentation. The manual is comprehensive and detailed, perfect for understanding specific tools and features. Three, practice and experiment, simple projects. Start with basic shapes and small models. Incremental complexity, gradually take on more complex projects as you get comfortable. Recommended learning path. One, interface and navigation. Spend at least a week familiarizing yourself with Blender's layout and controls. Two, modeling. Week two to three, focus on creating 3D objects using techniques like extruding, sculpting, and using modifiers. Tools to learn. Loop cuts, knife tool, beveling, and subdivision surfaces. Three, materials and textures. Week four to five, learn to apply materials and textures. Shaders and nodes. Understand the basics of Blender's node-based shader and four. Lighting, week six. Learn about different types of lights, point, sun, area, and spot, and how to set up lighting for your scenes. HDRI lighting. Use high dynamic range images for realistic lighting. Five. Week seven to eight, explore render engines, cycles in EV, render settings, and post-processing techniques. Camera settings, learn how to position and adjust the camera for the best shots. Six, animation. Week nine to 10, start with basic animation principles and gradually move on to more complex animations. Keyframes and graph editor. Understand how to set keyframes and use the graph editor for smooth animations. Seven, video editing. Week 11 to 12, learn how to edit your rendered animations or create videos using Blender's Video Sequence Editor. Sequencing and effects. Add effects, transitions, and audio to your videos. Tips for success. One, start small. Begin with simple projects and gradually increase complexity. Two, practice regularly. Consistent practice is key to improving your skills. Aim for daily or weekly projects. Three, join the Blender community. Forums. Engage with other Blender users on forums like Blender Artists. Social media. Follow Blender groups on Facebook, Twitter, and Reddit. Competitions and challenges. Participate in community challenges to push your skills. Four. Experiment. Don't be afraid to try new things and experiment with different techniques. Five. Break down complex tasks. Divide large projects into smaller, manageable steps. Plan your project workflow to stay organized. Six, stay updated. Blender is constantly evolving. Keep up with updates and new features through Blender's official channels and community news. Remember, learning a new software takes time and patience. Don't get discouraged if you encounter challenges. Keep practicing, and you'll see improvement over time. Happy blending.